fall. Karma always does, so I perform quite pretty. I was just thinking about how uh, most people, well, most of you years that will know me, um, will follow along, is um, that I was vegan and I was having that um, dilemma about free range eggs. Um, and I'm now um, eating them. So besides free range eggs, I would say I was mostly vegan except for these things. So um, basically I just crave honeycomb um, and what crunchies, but it's violet crumble, honeycomb and milk chocolate. So yeah, those are my two, well, that, this is my weakness, but that's not why I wanted to film myself. So it's uh, filling out the pillow box for the week time. Um, and obviously, like the majority of people, there's a narrator in my head. And I've got friends on in front of me for like the hundred millionth time. And um, I wanted to, I've been thinking about, it. let me just try this again. I did something earlier, which just proves, well at the moment I'm just keep thinking, you know, that I'm, like, I'm an idiot. And I'm not trying to beat myself up because I've just read like two the last few days I have no word of a lie being in actual real true fucking crisis state for two days about university so today has been a great day I did not look at my phone I got through many of the weekly content uh, learning objectives turns out Rachel was absolutely right She's quite smart like that. Um, and so much of what I've been just in overwhelm and stress and anxiety about is actually covered. Just like those bigger woman. Um, the chocolate's melting in my hand. Another thing, I've been trying to get the camera on the right level because the stand's quite tall and I can't quite get it right because my hands feel like fuck. I cannot find my iPod as well anywhere. Looks like someone's gonna ring me because I just got a little thing going. Recording will stop if you answer the phone. Um, but yeah, I can't get the camera right. <laughs> oh, making a mess there. Hmm. Those of you who might be new, fuck it out. I literally just turn the camera on and record myself, yep. Um, gets what I need out. The reason I was like, put the camera on, woman, and at least record your daily thoughts and whatever. Literally, diary. This is my very, very sharing diary that I share with everyone online. Um, and it works for me. My fucking phone keeps twisting because I can't tighten it enough to, um, make it stop. I managed to vacuum my house. Well, that's not true. Let me refresh. Re ugh. I managed to vacuum the main parts of my house after the work meeting while my hash browns were cooking. And um, I gotta admit, like, when it comes to work, I'm wondering when I'm gonna get to the point, yeah, where I stop writing myself notes <laughs> while paying attention to what's going on that basically always say the same thing, which is stop talking. <laughs> You're too intense. I don't know how else to tell a story though, because I don't know how else to be except be me, and this is who I am. 
um, and I quite like them, but I do understand that I might be full on. Um, but yes, the thing that I did that was dumb, well, there's two things when I think about it, I should have listened to Andrew, um, when he said, do you have a hammer to smash up that big fucking cigarette vape? And I was kind of like, I do, because I saw him today. I was like, I do have a hammer. I was like, not, I don't think I'm there to smashing up my very last of my eBay, right? Um, and it's like, I, yeah. I kept having this conversation with myself and I was like, no, let me rephrase this, okay? The urge, the addiction, the nicotine part of what makes us continue to keep smoking, even though it's disgusting, obviously is there. I've been smoking for the last... I don't know. I think three weeks ago is when I said I bought it on the Sunday, when I sort of did a big spring clean. Um, but the first time I went to my masseuse's place, right? And I remember having it and I was like, disgusting. Because I was at 42 days without one. And then however long it had been before that. And it was like 90 something days. Again, I make videos every day. I can literally go back and find it if I want to. I don't right now. I'm not even up to date with the current ones that I've posted. Um, I have seen Monday Night's one with all the crying. Like, I mean, that's what happened. That is reality. It obviously stays up. Um, I really can't remember if I'd seen my current therapy session. I don't think I've seen the one before, but again, I was saying to Andrew, I'm not really sure which ones I've seen and which ones I haven't seen as yet because, let's face it, I feel like I've been going into like my brain melting, yeah, um, since uni started. So, obviously, though, let's go back around. I was vacuuming and I was having this like, oh, like this morning, like I had it this morning, I told Andrew, and I was like, I know better than to give in to it. Plus, I literally said like I had an experiment with myself and as soon as I had the fucking eBay, the nicotine hit me and we're talking seconds, I went from feeling really good to really anxious. And of course I did what, you know, we all do and I thought I'd smoke some more because that would make it better. And we all saw how that went, didn't we? Um, which doesn't make any sense of any level, especially since I have this thing. And like I'm going to keep saying, this doctor recommended this one. I just have to not over that. Yeah? But um, I had some of the E cigarette and the re I think again like I I had no one I was gonna fuck it up or not even fuck it up I, I think I knew it was coming um oh, what's the matter? but um I was kind of like do I put it in the car what about the trip to uni blah 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 what's up Bobby um I'm guessing there's people out there I should really hurry up. I told myself I was going to turn the camera on. I was like, the one thing I have to remember is, oh, I didn't even do the mess, right? Um, I'm, I still need to shower and wash my hair. And I've already heated up my solarium um, for a decent amount of time, too. Um, so I chucked her on while it was vacuuming. And I would really like to tear. And though I will cover my face this time, because last time I put sunscreen on and didn't, and I still was like, oh, it's a little bit too red. It obviously gone, but still. What's up, boo? Um, but yes, the eBay. Yucky, yucky, yucky. I will not be putting it in my car. I still have not thrown it out yet. Oh, I haven't. I put it in the in the box that I just it's it's there, you know. I think also maybe because it's like Grant's birthday on the weekend, and I'm like, I know today I was more like I did it because. I always used to say back in the day, um, the hardest thing about quitting cigarettes for me is that I like it after a week. Um, and that's what happened today, basically. 
um yes but like i've said i'm very happy with where i'm at today i did have some of the fucking bait but i put it away because i was like yucky yucky not putting it in my car so i've learned all of that i'm making the main parts of my house um i'm now much more um aware of so many different things i need to be aware of for my assignment turns out if you just don't fall behind and stay up to date it does make life easier i make my life so much harder for myself but i definitely don't mean to it's just in hindsight that i can see it but as we know i learn as i go just like the next person um i haven't to share because not everyone else does and at least you know when i know i'm not alone it does make things easier i still think there's things in, in this world that are just what we don't understand <laughs> like we were talking us talking about values and and someone said they were really personal and not something people would want to share and i'm just in my head going i don't understand why would some of these values be a secret and i couldn't figure it out and i still haven't figured it out but i don't want to push it so i'm just talking it out but i guess we're all different and i can understand that someone might counter it with well you share everything true not true actually there are stuff i haven't shared um but yeah no that one i just don't get in general I've also been a part of like classes and stuff where we had just shared them all out loud so i don't think it's just a me thing in this regard truthfully um but like i said sometimes i just i don't know i do tell myself and notes to myself when i'm on like camera and like stuff for whatever it might be work or uni do not talk oh, oh. i do anyway let's face it um, but I have talked for just over 12 minutes and I really do have to fill this and at least shower and wash my hair because, um, I have asked for help and should be in a knock on the door like sometime just after 6am. Um, and I, I, yeah, I need to go to sleep at a decent time. I, I like think it was half past seven-ish when I started making this. Um, but yes. Anyway, let's see if the little remote control thing wants to work for me. Um, I'm very happy I'm doing much better. I guess my takeaway from everything is, oh, there's a lot, but the university is not here to break us. Look at what I have to deal with just to function correctly. Um, so I'm just happy that I'm in a better place. Um, that I do have people I can talk to um, and a good support network. I find that really helpful. Um, obviously, if you need, see, this is where my like part of my support part kicks in, and I'm just like, oh, I, yeah. Obviously, um, if anyone needs to, you know, need someone to chat with, you are welcome to email me. Uh, please don't bombard me on the other hand with a billion questions a day about how i'm going where i'm going what i'm doing because i'm too busy to answer those types of emails um but i obviously care about everyone and like i said i share because i know that so many people are going through what i go through um and the one thing i find that helps me anything in the whole world is knowing I'm not alone um and because of that I'm going to keep sharing and I think I'll get to a point where I stop writing those notes to myself um but I don't know I would love to be a much calmer more person that would be someone who's just got low levels of stressing. I don't feel like I have high neuroticism, which is obviously what I'm learning about in personality right now. 
but again I'm a very passionate over the top loud intense sometimes forget I shouldn't be quite so graphic or explain things the way that I do or in so much detail I think that's not true I think I always forget that um, I'm not sure if I think that I need to I should do or what I'm thinking right now I'm not overthinking by this point because I needed to end this video like three minutes ago because I really want to tan people I really want to tan I bought the solarium for a reason not just tanning true really. it very much helps with my pain which is another thing I need to do oh but I have booked a massage for Monday and she's so sweet like I don't understand her language whatsoever and every time I hear from her now she's like I miss you I love you your beautiful friend we're friends now and I'm like yeah cool absolutely that's what I'm putting out into the universe that's definitely what I'm getting back so um I guess that there would be my number one takeaway from it all is where we're vibing at is affecting us um but we're not alone I'm not alone fucking the last two days I look back and I'm just like literally feel like dissociated from it and it's like I fully have dissociation disorder and that's not the same as multiple personality disorder because there aren't different me's they're just different versions of me's um but this one who's never along needs to finish filling the pill up because like so much stuff people um, and then tan and then shower and go to bed. Mwah. Night old. Oh, let's see if I want it to work. And no.